Hey everyone, it's Jared here. I use a lot of grids in some of the content that I post because it's a great way to show comparison between art. It's a great way to show collages of work. It's a great way to display different types of work that is visual. And the best thing is with grids, you can use uh, photos, but you can also combine different types of video as well. This is all done through Adobe Express. I'm going to quickly show you how it's done. Go to Adobe Express. You want to open up a brand new file it can be in any sort of shape or size that you want. We're going to go 16 by 9. The side of the editor that opens, there is a button called grids. And once you click this, you can see all these different types of grid formations for you to use. My personal favorite one is kind of like the four rectangles or the four split grid, and you can drag that across your entire timeline. What's cool as well is you can also adjust the thickness of the grid line as well. I like to keep it quite thin, but again, this gives you a lot of flexibility. You can also change the color too. Once this is done, start dragging and dropping in different things. I put in a couple static images here, but you can see that you can also drag in videos as well. And these videos can play concurrently with each other, which is really, really cool. You can be really creative here with how you want to display all your fantastic visual work. And once you're done, hit download on the top right button and you'll download either a PNG, a JPEG, or even a movie file like an MP4, and you can upload it straight to your favorite social media network. That's it, it's as simple as that. I love using this feature. I love the drag and drop aspect of it. It works also on the Adobe Express app on your phone. And it, for me, it's just a fantastic way to show off visual stuff. So hope you have found this helpful. And if you have any questions at all, drop, drop them down in the comments and I'll be there to answer them. Thank you.